G'day, Brenton here, VK2 MEV, and I'm just out in the field quickly at sunset to try and work out if you can make a delta loop uh, for 40 meters with three squid poles. And the short answer is you can. We have one pole there, that's a 10 meter pole from Haverford. And then another pole you can just see against the sky there. And you can probably just see the wire going up to a third pole there. That's tight to my ute because the ground is full of concrete and we couldn't get tent pegs into it. Um, and on the analyzer, we can see here we've got, try and find the two to one bandwidth for you. Where are we? That's uh, 7.25 roughly down to, oh, it's a bit far, down to about 7.06. So there's our two to one bandwidth. Um, probably worth noting that at the feed point there, we do only have a one to one balance, not the, uh, the two to one or four to one that's normally used in these delta loops. Um, what I'm guessing is that the ground proximity, I'll try and uh, get a broad view here, I think that the ground proximity is um, causing the input impedance to, uh, to drop quite significantly. So uh, that's just our experimental results. So let's uh, see how it receives on air. I didn't add someone like this. Is that S double plus? Yeah. That's very cool. That will actually for the big one. He was in hospital there. That's about. I think I've got everybody. Anyway, everyone's just S plus on this antenna. I love it. It's a bit chilly this morning. I don't know. Probably about minus two. Minus plus. I am stationed in there anyway. <laughs> well, <laughs> we don't have anything to compare it to, but it gets the job done, obviously. <laughs>